Welcome back, True Seeker. July 3rd, 2024, the last day of the United States of America being 247 years old. And one of the big headlines tonight, the Boston Globe, their editorial board coming out and saying, Joe Biden, you need to step down. Notice how uh, the media emphasizes the words historically bad in regards to that Boston Globe story. Look at the gematria of historically bad, 247. Last day of the country being 247 years old. 68, like the year they keep comparing this to. 68, the year of the RFK and MLK assassination. Remember, Joe Biden has the same November 20th birthday as RFK. And of course, RFK Jr. is in this race. Also, 54 date numerology today. Remember, Jesuit order equals 54, like Ambassador Hotel, like Dealey Plaza. Those are the places the Kennedys got smoked. But Boston Globe 54 going with the 54 date numerology, again, like Jesuit order. And the big way, Boston Globe's 126, and today is a span of 126 days to the election. In other news, yesterday we talked about how the 25th Amendment could come up. Fox News has a big headline about it tonight, the very next day. Remember, Time Magazine, way back in 2017, predicted that Trump would be removed with the 25th Amendment. Both Trump and Biden equal 25. You need Kamala Harris to remove Joe with the 25th Amendment. But again, just Biden and Trump both 25. Headlines like this about Trump once upon a time. Now here they are about Biden. Um, shout out to Anna who had a great observation on the Sanhedrin and Luke 10.1. Some numbers we talk about. I think she's advanced the research. I'll do a, I'll do a longer stream on this later when I get a chance. I meant to do a live stream today but ran out of time. Um, we'll talk more about the hurricane later. Uh, the Signum Global founder, Charles Myers, came out against Joe Biden today. Remember yesterday it was Lloyd Dodgett who invoked the name Lyndon B. Johnson when he spoke about how Biden needs to step down. Again, Lyndon B. Johnson replaced the only other Catholic president. That was JFK killed at age 46, whereas Joe Biden's the second Catholic president, number 46, Again, elected 46 weeks after the Pope's birthday, after the death of his son at 46. And isn't it interesting, though, that these two guys in back-to-back -back days that, that, that start the, uh, the movement against Biden from the, the big donors to the Democratic Party, both of their names equal 56, like Society of Jesus, like Washington, D.C., like the pattern we talk about all the time. And this one right here, this was, this was CNN's front page for a lot of today, July 3rd, 2024 the day before Independence Day. Biden, absolutely not considering quitting race, White House says. So mixed messages coming out of the party. But uh, absolutely not that phrase. You can see it. 46 for Joe Biden, number 46. Again, in Gematria, Catholic equals 46. Sacrifice equals 46. Genesis 46 about sacrifice. RFK, the initials have that value of 46. Notice those remarks came from the press secretary, Corinne Jean-Pierre, and those remarks came 325 days after her birthday, which is also 46 weeks and three days. And notice she's the 35th White House press secretary. Again, JFK was number 35, killed on Interstate 35 at age 46. Joe Biden's elected 46 weeks after the Pope's birthday, inaugurated on the Pope's 35th day of his age. Hunter Biden's going through it, born on the 35th day of the year again. Bo Biden, dead at 46. The word Catholic in Gematria equates to 35 when you run the alphabetic order forwards, 46 and you run it in reverse. Um, the 325 days goes with Joe Biden's full name, Joseph Robinette Biden. Big number with the Scottish Rite, the rights of the Scottish Rite, written by the Jesuit order. And speaking of the Jesuits, today's 199 days after the Pope's birthday, the 46th prime number. There's a number of th other things that are interesting. Uh, again, I I'm skipping through these stories as quickly as possible, but please do check out my website, gematrieeffect.news. Um, did a post looking back into Joseph Kennedy's unpaid taxes to Canada for exporting alcohol in the time of prohibition, which of course ended in 33. And um, notice in the, in the article it says, as soon as prohibition ended, the same Joseph Kennedy set up a, an export, import alcohol business with Canada called Somerset. And 
In Gematria, again, Kennedy equals 33, like alcohol, like prohibition ended in 33. Sugar also equals 33, and that's mostly what alcohol is made out of, and a lot of people struggle with sugar addiction and alcohol addiction, and they are deadly killers that create a lot of disease and illness that Big Pharma makes a lot of money off of. But anyway, Kennedy and alcohol are 33. The name of his company, the way he spelled it, Somerset, S-O-M-E-R-S-E-T, also 33. You know, what are the odds? And um, we were talking about the significance of the hockey team beating Canada this year when the NBA Finals and the Stanley Cup paid tribute to the dead Kennedys. It was harder to see with the hockey one because the hockey rink where the Florida Panthers won is right next to Parkland, Florida, where the school shooting happened on February 14th, 214, like how JFK died at Parkland Hospital in the 214 area code. Of course, the NBA Finals was, again, Boston over Dallas, you know, Kennedy family, Boston, JFK dead in Dallas, where Lyndon Johnson's from down in Stonewall, Texas. The NBA and NHL playoffs began on the first day or on the same day for the first time in history, the 111th day of the year when Kennedy has that Gematria 111 and 78. And again, it was the 78th NBA season and the Boston Celtics won the finals that began on their 78th birthday and so on and so forth. Yesterday, Trump gets the, uh, the court case moved. 78 days from yesterday to September 18th, the anniversary of the CIA being founded in a big Jesuit ritual and the cornerstone being laid for D.C., the Jesuit stronghold by George Washington, who was inaugurated in the year that the Jesuits set up Georgetown, 1789. Funny enough, George equals 57 the big way, like Georgetown equals 57 the small way, the age of George Washington when he was inaugurated, and Rome also equals 57, like D.C. used to be called on... D.C. used to be known as Rome on the Potomac. The Jesuits served the Roman Catholic Church. But yeah, again, this whole 78 thing, it also matters that Trump just turned 78. And again, game four of the NBA Finals, the only game that Dallas won on Trump's 78th birthday, where Luka Doncic, the star of the teams from Slovenia, like Melania. And again, these finals began 78 days after Barron Trump's 18th birthday as the Celtics won their 18th championship. Again, those finals began on the Celtics' 78th birthday in Boston. Celtics are the only team in the league with full Gematria's 78. Again, Joe Biden's secret service name, Celtic. He's number 46. The Celtics came into 46, came into the series with 46 all-time wins versus Dallas. But um, again, just the 78 piece, so huge in the finals. The Celtics averaged 106 points a game in the finals. That's the 78th composite number. Just so much 78 in those finals. With Trump turning 78 years old, 78 cards in the tarot deck, it reminds us that Arturo Sosa became the superior general, the leader of the Jesuits on the day leaving 78 days left in the year, right before Trump won the 2016 election and won with a big asterisk because it's all scripted. It's all political theater. It's all Jesuit political script. But um, remember, the Jesuits have been banned. They had to be suppressed by the church because they're just too damn political. They're too much in everybody's business. Anyhow, Arturo Sosa, he did become Superior General 25 days before the election. Again, Trump's got that 25. Big number. So there's a lot more to say about that as well. I'll talk about these things more when I have time to do a longer stream, but just to do an abbreviated one. Uh, lots of new posts up today. And again, just uh, the news media this morning started with rumors that uh, people close to Biden were telling him to step down. By the evening time, he's... He's not considering stepping down. News are talking about, is Kamala Harris ready? <laughs> oh, man. Um, well, let's just hope uh, Joe Biden and Jimmy Carter don't become the next pair of presidents to die on the same day in history. So, yeah, lots of, lots of new content up today. I'm scrolling through all of it. Ran out of time to do the live stream, gematrieffect.news. If you never use my website, you can get to my ebooks here. Merch, calculator, you can download the calculator for free. Works offline. You can get it for Apple or Google Play Stores. So leave it there for now, True Seeker. Until next time.